to HRP. This is the call. Welcome to HRP. This is the solved question paper of the Gur district. At first, here are MCQ for 10 marks. First one, which of the following is not a valid IPv4 address? For that you remember, IPv4 address always in the range of 1 to 255 and it will be in four groups and also will be separated by dots. So you see here at the first number 154, 152, 435. So this is valid. Second one 165, 287. The second one 287 which is above 255. So the second one is invalid and other all are valid IPv4 address. Number B, Ethernet hardware is the other name of MAC address. I have some doubt on this answers. If it is another one, I will write in comment section. Number C, the editor that allow developer to see what the result look. It will be Amaya. SRC attribute is, uh, attribute is used with image stands for source. Then insert update delete this command comes under it comes under data manipulation language DML. Then a table name should begin with the answer is alphabet. This tag is used to create text box. It will be input, which is the largest type of network, pan. And the syntax to give comment, it will be the second one. The command used to modify the content of a table, it will be update. If the structure, the answer is alter table and if it is content, it, the answer will be update. Then here are the fill in the blanks. You can pause the screen and go through the answers. After that, one, uh, one word answer for five marks. It is an attribute of TD tag which determines the space between border and the content of the cell. It is padding. It is a device that walk like hub also keeps some routing information. It is switch. Exit control. It will be do while. Name the first object oriented language. It is simula. It is the basic unit of op object. What is molymorphism? These are for two marks. After that, uh, how pointer variable is different from a uh, normal variable. Then list the arithmetic operators. What is a markup language? Here you can give example also, for example, HTML, XML, etc. Define class. A class is user defined data type. It consists data member and functions, which can be created by an instance, which is known as object. Two type of text input. These are single line input and multi line text input. Why do you include hyperlink to link one page with another and also to attach external files like uh, in a website you are getting download links when you click on the download link some external file is used to download in your computer for that also we can use href tag write the style for list style type it will be like a list style type column then the value the value can be anything like a dig circle square capital alphabet lower these are there in book you can see all the values you can write all the values if you want define array why we used array in a computer program here is the answer get two example of backend application in uh, used in HTML it will be MySQL and PHP now see directly when we create a web page by using HTML it give only the font view when you are creating form you might observe that when you click the submit button nothing happens so if you want that uh, that the page must be workable, then you have to create a database where you will store the data. For that, we need MySQL. And to write the MySQL command, to execute the MySQL command, we will require a programming language. For that, we can use PHP. So this will be backend language. HTML and CSS, they are front end. Means it gives only the look, but it does not do any functional work for the web page. What is the use of password? It marks the character as soon as the user enter it. Rules for naming a table. These are the rules. This is very common question. Learn the answer. Then mention three characteristics of POP. These are the answers. Top down approach, function based, global data access. 
then what are the different uh, different type of function it is user defined and library function can we compare http and ftp yes after that you can write this definitions then number d explain the term tag and attribute you can write this uh, the tag are the content which we write uh, inside angular brackets and the attribute it gives some additional information about the tag an example you can write like tag name one space attribute name then value for example body basic color equal yellow and body close write a c program for the pattern one square plus two square plus four square so the program will be this one will need total three variable i n and sum will take the value of n from the user after that will create a for loop and will continue the loop till the value becomes equal to n and inside the loop we will calculate the sum we will write sum equals sum plus i into i then write a source code to create web page which will display your class timetable i think this is from the old book this question paper, uh, question the answer will be <coughs> too long for theory exam still i have given the answer you can practice for practical exam here i am creating a table there i have created a five there i created a six columns and seven rows like each column will have day first period second period third period fourth period then we are writing the subject name and here i forgot to write this sunday and monday at first you will write this one monday and second tier again you will write tuesday this one you will write means each tier will have uh, six time td means six columns so th this way you can write this one the answer is easy but it is too long then write a program to define a function square then the function must return the square of that number so here i am de declaring a function int square and passing one parameter int n and i am directly return n into n means whatever value i will get in n that i will multiply two times and return it to the function which is calling it and here i am taking the value of n after that i am calling the function here so whatever value the function returns it will store in result and will get the answer and this is from mysql this is the most popular question for mysql here we have to create a table the table name is customer and the database name is business and after that we have to insert five record then we have to display the structure of the table and after that we have to display customer name and customer mobile so here i am creating the first database create database business after that selecting the database by using use business then i am creating the table by writing this command and after that i am inserting five records by writing these commands and for displaying the structure of the table i am writing desc customer and to displaying customer name and customer mobile i am writing select customer name comma customer mobile from customer so these are the solved answer of debug heuristic the pdf link will be available in description and password will be inside the video you will get the password there thank you for watching see you in a new video till then take care and bye